bleach. This is so cool. Imagine these acids in your favorite video games. Look how incredible this is. It's so cool. I want to go in. I want to swim. Oh, wait, that's a waterfall. This is called the fluid flux. This you can actually get yourself. You can download this demo. Now, this is really cool because this water simulation is going to fill up this entire area. It hasn't filled up yet, but as you can see, the water is naturally just flowing down the rocks, figuring out its way. And the greatest part is that these objects here react with the water. Look at the buoyancy of these objects. Look at how they swirl around and float with the currents of the water. It is absolutely amazing. And you get this realistic ripples and the bubbles etc and then if we go down here let's let's go down here oh no where am i did i die already no i'm right here oh god apparently i don't know how to swim inside games as well as real life so this whole place is gonna be filled with this water and that boat's gonna start floating so i'm gonna get out of here somehow because i'm fighting through the currents and we're gonna go down here look at that the water is starting to fill up where the boat is and you're gonna see the boat float up as look at that do you see that do you see how it's now starting to move look look at this and as the water fills up this place even more, that boat is gonna float and float and float and until eventually it's going to just be boating around. And it's really cool. It's all physically simulated, accurate, and the buoyancy of the water physics is what really impresses me. Now, I can also do this trick right here. I can ragdoll myself. Look at that. I'm just this floating piece of human robot and I float with the current. Isn't that cool? So I'm gonna go up here where the current is strongest and i'm gonna dedge myself like around here dedge and as i dedge myself you'll see that i am moving and with the current and oh i just got stuck on, on a rock i'm going to dedge myself again and you can see look at that i hit the rock i get stuck because real physics dedge and we start floating there we go Look at that, and we're just going through this vortex. I guess that's where the water is gonna sink in. I guess that's the sinkhole right here. But look at how realistic the ripples are. Look at this chat. I feel like swimming. I actually feel like swimming in here. There's something really satisfying about realistic graphics and realistic physics. And the crazy part is, is like the future is here. This is all real time. This is real. You can put this in your games. Imagine we have this in GTA 6. It'd be absolutely cool, wouldn't it? So now we're gonna go underwater and we're gonna see what it looks like underwater because you can't... Ooh, look at that. Look how realistic the sound is. The sand is moving. Oh, a little bit, yes. The refraction is amazing as well. The water refraction lighting effects. So we are going to go to a different level in this. Holy... This is a beach map. Wow. Look at this chat. Look at the waves. Oh. Oh man, the beach is dirty, but honestly, our oceans need to be cleaned up. So this is a very realistic simulation of plastic as well. Look at the plastic polluting the ocean. This is so realistic. We're gonna try to ragdoll once more. I'm gonna get into the surface a little bit and I'm gonna ragdoll and I'm gonna see what happens. Oh, there is a dead body. Look at how it's getting kind of crashed with the waves. I think the waves are coming at some point. We got that little wave there. Wow, look at how I'm floating. Let's see how the body is limp and it's just flowing with the water, chat. Let's go to the beach here. Okay, so I'm gonna just ragdoll right here, chat. And you can see how the waves are interacting with the physics of my body. And then come over here again. Yeah. Giving up on life right here. Look at that. It is so cool. It's so cool. I really, really just wanna... I wanna go in. I wanna swim. And the beach goes out so far. It just keeps going you just need a shark to chase you let's check out a different map we're gonna go to the island map <gasps> this is the island map and i'm going to ragdoll myself like right here wow oh dude check out how i'm moving with the wave do you guys see that it's actually pulling me up to shore look at that and we're going out to the further sea i guess here wow the water is so blue <gasps> Oh my goodness. Ooh, Chad, this is a great ocean. Imagine, imagine a freaking whale coming out. Look at that. Let's go up, back up in here. Let's go back up. Let's
let's go back up. Oh no, I'm lost in the sea. The vast, vast ocean. Let's now go to the section map. Ooh, okay. So the section map here, I think, just kind of shows... Ooh, ooh, they show you how the simulations work in a very... Oh god, I fell off. I fell off. I fell off. They, they kind of individually show you guys how the, simul the water simulation works. This is the waves here. Little ripples of waves. And you can kind of see how it interacts with the surface. That's really cool. The, the greatest thing about the fluid is that they, it actually crashes into the rock. Wow, look at how it goes into the crooks and crannies of the rocks and creates the bubbles. This is very cool. Now let's go into the world map here. <gasps> oh my god! Are you seeing this? Look how incredible this is! Look at this! It's a whole world, a whole island! <gasps> you can see how the waves are rippling on the surface, as well as creating those caustics. It's a whole world right here. Now I'm gonna do my favorite simulation where I ragdoll here, and we watch the waves kind of pull me into shore. I am nerding out so hard, and look at the beautiful refractions on the water itself. It is green because we're much more closer to the sand. The sand reflection onto the water creates this beautiful moss green water. And then if we go deeper, where there's the, the sand falls off into more deeper areas, the water as well changes color into being a darker blue. This is so cool. Imagine these acids in your favorite video games. And the crazy part is that video games are becoming exponentially more advanced from npc ais where you can actually interact with ais like they're real people to real ass simulations even programming is getting improved by ai you know i wanted to see if it was possible for chat gpt to write me blueprints it given a prompt and it did it was pretty impossible to load it all up because it just kept wanting to load and load and load and it's a lot of code and it takes forever but the capabilities is there if i oh look look at this if i look up you can see the sun bouncing off the water and creating this really cool rippling lighting effect so the great thing about this is that you can also buy these assets and put them in your video games which means that we could put miko in here as well now chat let's go to the next session this is the waterfall map and i am curious oh i see so this is the water and it's, and it's filling this place up i wonder if the sounds are all tied in with the water as well which is absolutely just mind-boggling all right chat i'm going to wrap on myself and i'm going to float with the currents here we go we're slowly making way down down to the waters below we are going with the flow and look at those balls bouncing in the distance with the same type of buoyancy is this visual smr doesn't it feel feel like visual ASMR? There's something about realistic game simulations that feel like... <gasps> Wait, it's a waterfall! Oh, that's why it's called a waterfall! <gasps> Here we go! Oh my god! That was cool. That was awesome. Oh, there's a fish! Chad, there's fishes here! That is cool. Cool. Remember, chat, this was not filled with water just 10 seconds ago. The physics filled this area all real time. Can you plug these assets into makeovers? Theoretically, yes. We could, actually. I don't see why not. I say that and my developers are pulling their hair out going, Why would you suggest that? Why? Oh, look at that. I can I can hide into the into the rocks, into the boulders here. I really do enjoy looking up at the sun and seeing the light refractions. And the sounds really make it super immersive. Okay, chat. Oh, you can move the sun as well. Look at chat. We're gonna have the power to move the sun. You wanna see? We're gonna go back into the surface. And we're gonna, with the power of the engine, we are going to move the sun. Ooh. Look how I'm changing the lighting. Ooh! The sunset. Look at that! Wow! 
it. So cool. I love it. Real time. Oh my goodness. It's pretty cool how the water level keeps going up. You're right. You're actually right. The water level keeps on going up. So theoretically, if we stayed here and there isn't... Ooh, look at the red water. And if there isn't like a place where it's draining out, it would theoretically just flood this entire place. Yeah, that's true. Hey guys, if you like this video and you want to see more, hit that like and subscribe button. If you think I'm fun and you want to hang out with me, come to my Twitch channel. I stream from 12.30pm PST, Thursday to Sunday.